welcome back to my channel. We are on our way to Elma Resort. We are on our way to the, where are we going? Beach. To the beach. Yeah, so in this video, I'll be sharing with you our experience, what to expect. By the way, for those of you who haven't subscribed yet, please do and hit the notification bell so that you'll be notified whenever I have new videos just like this. Anyways, if you guys are interested to know more, stick around because I'm here to pass it on. early so we checked in had our lunch and right now we are here quick room tour for you all so when you get inside uh, here to my left is their kitchen so here ta-da so they have a refrigerator they have a microwave, um, electric kettle, which is really good. And right here are the rooms. So they have two rooms here. This room right here has two single beds. And they have their own toilet here and shower. And here... In the other room. Ta da! So, this is a king, king bed, and we have the balcony right over here, overlooking the beach, and it has its own, it has its own toilet and shower as well. So, I'm gonna go out. And right here, so we're back here at the um, main door. So right here on the other side, to my right, is their sala. <laughs> right here. And then, it has access to the balcony.
are you having? What are you eating, Renee? Eating, eating, grapefruit and apple. Mmm. Your favorite? Yeah, it's my favorite. Apple. our way to breakfast so supposedly we we're gonna wake up very early to catch the sunrise but <laughs> I woke up at 4 30 a.m. and then I went back to sleep <laughs> thankfully it is a sunny sunny day so we're gonna have our breakfast and then we're gonna swim so it is quite a long way to get to the beach so that is our casita right there and this is the way to the beach there right there There, see? It, it won't bite. Oh, see, it won't bite. Don't squeeze it, okay? Because it will get yaya. Yeah, yeah. You get it, you get it. You get it. Yeah, can you flex, you hold. Uh, Roar! Uh, Roar! Yay! <laughs> <laughs>
afternoon nap. We had our snacks as well. And right now, it is 5 p.m. And we are waiting for the cart to go to the swimming pool. So that's the thing. You have to ride a cart going to the swimming pool because it is quite far. And you do have to make a reservation. And the reservation is for an hour of use. So we have 5 to 6 p.m. our slot and we have about less than an hour to enjoy their pool. So let's go. Also, before I forget, their pool and the beach is only until 5 o'clock or 6 o'clock. So today it is until 6 o'clock. Okay, so we just decided to walk and it's actually not very far. Okay lang. Pwede rin yung day siya lakpun, guys. O pwede naman yung malakaw. O gusto yung ka malakaw. <laughs> Here, their fountain. General Manager of Elmar Resort and Spa, Miss Grace Marta Lame. Hello, Miss. Hello. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. Thank you very much for gracing my channel. Pleasure is mine. Yes. All right. So, Miss, what can guests expect here at Elmar Resort and Spa? Oh, first and foremost, um, we're actually now into mental health, right? Now, yeah. post pandemic, here at Elmar Resort and Spa, it's a place of solace. Mm -hmm. rejuvenating place and of course the traditional Filipino hospitality when we say hospitality it's not just about service but with a taste of the food and mm -hmm. your accommodation itself this is a safe heaven for you and your family that's true I agree we really enjoyed our stay here we love the food customer service as well thank you so much thank you um, our team actually uh, we are a work in progress when it comes to service. Of course, we need to enhance every day. We base it in the comments of our guests. It's a room for improvement. There is no such thing as perfect hospitality. But my team and I always, we try our best to be beyond the expectation of our guests. Yeah, so yes, I see a lot of um, under construction right. developments. So what else can we expect here in the coming months? Well, I can't say the timetable, <laughs> of course. Yeah. But then again, for Elmar, there is a lot of things that is happening. There are a lot of projects in the pipeline. 
And that is something that our guests should be looking forward to. We will be having additional inventories mm -hmm. to cater the needs for demand of our guests. Mm -hmm. We're almost always fully booked because, again, wow. we have this pristine and prime beach yes. right in front of you. So, hence, a lot of people would really want to rejuvenate and refresh themselves here. So, there is a demand for more rooms. And we are going to deliver that to our guests. Right now, you only have 24 rooms. That's correct, yes. 24 rooms. Um, we have the deluxe room. Mm -hmm. Then we have the deluxe premier, mm -hmm. the family room, casitas, and the presidential suites. Mm -hmm. All of these, uh, the rates and the photos is in our Facebook page. You may want to visit it so mm -hmm. you, you can know more about our rates, our promo rates on weekdays and on weekends. Yeah, but you know what, Miss? I have to say, even if you are fully booked, you can really feel the exclusivity because you have a very big, Indeed. very big property here. Indeed. <laughs> yes, this is an 89 hectares property. Wow. Hence, there is a long white sand yes. stretch for you to just walk around and have that time for yourself and for your family. Yeah, that's yes. right. You mentioned a while ago that Elmar is a sister company of Safari. Yeah, Cebu yes. Safari. So if you are check in at the Cebu Safari, you can come here. That's right. We right. do have packages that um, the promo rates for the rooms and the um, tour at mm -hmm. Safari, it is actually intertwined with each other. Wow. So please do visit our web pages mm -hmm. because all of the promotions are there posted. So it's more of like see you in the wild yes so I it's love see it. with the wild yes, yes perfect perfect pleasure pleasure so miss why don't you invite everyone to come here at elmar resort sure thank you for that hi um for the followers of actually <laughs> tara please if they have enjoyed visiting elmar you will have the chance to take advantage of that solace and rejuvenating that you need after this pandemic See you all here. See you. See you. See you in the wild. Yes. Thank you, Miss. Pleasure. <laughs> hey, everyone. So we will be checking out in a while. And as usual, I am here to give you our feedback. First and foremost, their accommodation. We are checked in here at their casita. We love that it is very spacious. It has two rooms with own toilet and bath. It has a kitchen living area, the balcony. What we wish though is that the casita would have its own pool or a jacuzzi or bathtub or a common pool nearby. All the casitas would be perfect. Also, please take note that the casitas are a bit far from the beach. If you are considering an accommodation and if you want to be closer to the beach, the nearest are actually two family deluxe rooms and behind those rooms are the premier rooms and the deluxe rooms and then the casitas. So if you want a little bit more privacy, then we recommend the Casitas. It is situated on top of a hill, so it is elevated. You, re you get a really nice view, but if you want to be closer to the beach, again, we suggest the Family Deluxe, the Premier Rooms, or the Deluxe Rooms. Next is the beach. We love that it has a very long shoreline we enjoyed our time swimming especially with the good weather very sunny weather that is another thing to take note make sure to check the weather forecast before booking and we also like our we also enjoyed rather our time kayaking they offer free 30 minutes kayak for every room if you want to do other activities besides swimming, kayaking, they also have jet skis for rent and stand-up paddle. And oh, a tip for you all, make sure to check the high tide schedule. In our case, 
swimming between 8 to 12, 8 a.m. to 12 noon was the best time. By the way, the beach and their pool is open from 6 a.m. to 5 p.m. or 6 or 7 p.m. It really depends. You have to double check with the staff to make sure their schedule of the day. It changes from time to time. Sometimes it's 5 p.m., 6 or 7 p.m. Next is their pool. At the moment, they only have one pool and it is actually quite small, which is why you have to make a reservation if you want to use their pool. Each room can only use the pool for an hour. Next, their restaurants or their food. So they have two restaurants at the moment. They have the Sunrise Restaurant, which offers international cuisine and they have La Playa, which offers Filipino cuisine. Both are near the beach, by the way. Okay, so for their food, although they offer international cuisine at the Sunrise Restaurant, their strength is really their Filipino cuisine at the La Playa Restaurant. That is, of course, based on our preference. But they do offer some international cuisine buffets, like the Korean, Mediterranean, and Chinese, which is usually offered during the weekends. And they also have an acoustic band right over there at the Sunrise Restaurant, again, during weekends. Next is their customer service. One of the best customer service experiences we've ever had in a resort, especially the staff there at the Sunrise Restaurant. They're very accommodating, they really take the initiative, like for example, we ask for milk, they really ask, do you want it warm? Do you want it, do you want it just a regular milk? They really tend to the needs of the customers. Like they don't just stand there on the side, they really ask you, how is the food? Is everything okay? Do you need anything? So good job guys, good job to the staff here at Elmar Resort and Spa. And last but not the least, their connectivity is good. Our Globe mobile signal is available all throughout the resort as well as their Wi-Fi connection. It is even available at the beach, so it's really good. Overall, we really had a great time. We really enjoyed, as what I mentioned, we really enjoyed the beach because we are a family who loves the beach. In fact, we love the beach more than the pool, I mean, in general. And then it was our first time kayaking with Renee, one for the books experience. Uh, we would love to come back here when the rest of the developments are already in place. Like they plan to have a mini zoo, an infinity pool, and they also plan to have a playground. So we Definitely look forward to those things here at Elmar. So that's it. I hope you find this video helpful. And if it does, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Hey, come here. Say subscribe. Say subscribe. <laughs> Hit the notification bell so that you'll be notified whenever I have new videos. And I'll see you on the next one. If you have any questions, don't forget, feel free, rather, to drop a comment down below. See you in the next one. Bye. Say bye. 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 <laughs> Bye. Bye.